mean ultimately then for Ripple's business expansion? Are you looking at sort of uh, hiring in Europe here? Are you looking at expanding uh, offices here in Europe as a result? We are, yes. Uh, so we have our hub in London, uh, but we have nine offices around the world. And we're growing our team primarily outside the U.S., which is where our business is. Last quarter, about 75% of our uh, flagship product, the payment network, the flows were outside the U.S. Going to a different economy, and we're going to be learning more about that uh, as we go, but clearly we're, we're, we're learning that things can be done uh, from remote, remote locations. We're learning that technology can replace people even more than we thought. We're not going back to the same economy. We're going, we're recovering, but to a different economy. And it'll be one that is more leveraged to technology. And I worry that that is going to make it even more difficult than it was for, for many workers. In Silicon Valley and my friends who work in technology know that what we did to the manufacturing workers, we are now going to do to the retail workers, the call center workers, the fast food workers, the truck drivers, and then even bookkeepers, accountants, uh, insurance agents, lawyers, and on and on through the economy. So what happened to the manufacturing workers is a very clear sign. And so we'll import Chinese-based CBDC technology. So it's going to be CBDC in a box uh, provided to you by the People's Bank of China. Welcome, Welcome to, to the Crypto, crypto teacher. teacher. And guys, please like and subscribe if you do like what you're listening to. Please inform your friends and family and spread all over social media. It is imperative that we get back to learning finances and understand how the world really works because once we understand how the world really works, we understand that it is all planned out. Now, I want to thank those who purchased the books Crypto Teacher and the New Road Order book. Remember, the New Road Order book shows you how the world really works and it is definitely time for you to wake up out of that sleep, especially in the times that we're in right now. Now, guys, I told you in 2023, in the first quarter, we would get an event. And now we have the banking collapse, which the master magicians pulled off the perfect distraction. And at the end of the third quarter, going into the fourth quarter, guys, we're going to have another main event. Now, of course, the markets will still pump and dump until we get that next crisis. Guys, we know they're going to pull that rug. And all we have to do is watch the Fed to know exactly when that's about to happen. And also, guys, I want to thank those who purchased the three kids' books. It's time to re-educate. Also, much love to those who donate to the Cash Shop Patreon. Much love. Keep it coming. Guys, if you're not a part of the Patreon, make sure you're donating to the channel through the actual Cash App. We all know this channel is shadow banned. Now, guys, in my Patreon, I keep you up to date with the New Road Order events, and then also I give you the New Road Order cryptos. But, of course, you have to do your own research. But, guys, this next Bitcoin and crypto bull run is going to be a utility run. So you want to make sure you have the cryptos that have real utility. And much love to those who are shopping at both stores. Keep it coming. And of course, guys, we get into Bitcoin and cryptos first. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. And guys, we had Bitcoin and crypto move up slightly as the stock market opened. We are starting to pull back and we can clearly see why. As we see, looking at the actual yield rates, guys, make sure you're paying attention to the actual indicators. As we can see, as the stock market opened, we saw yield rates get pushed down. As we can see now, they're rising. And then, of course, guys, we have the dollar up, which we know doesn't help stocks and cryptos or gold. Now, we have volume, which is low. We have Tether, USDC. And then, of course, we have the Fed. Repo at $2.1 trillion, And we know the central banks are raising rates and running off the balance sheet in order to destroy this legacy market so the fourth industrial revolution can rise. And, guys, most likely we know the Fed is going to raise one more time and don't forget the Fed meeting is at the beginning of May. I think they meet on the 2nd and the 3rd. We know inflation is still high, but we know a lot of this inflation is just simple corporate greed. We know when it comes to our food, everything is owned by a handful of companies. Same thing when it comes to communications. It's just the illusion of choice. And guys, we know the NWO is stepping up the distractions. 
after getting the news that Brazil is getting off the dollar. We know China and Russia has been moving off of the dollar. We know in past history, we know there would be a bomb that dropped. But now we don't hear anything from the White House. We know this is an orchestrated plan to destroy the dollar. Remember, they want to get on an even playing field. Bretton Woods 2.0. And that's where Bitcoin, crypto, these stable coins, CBDCs, come into play. And we know if we stayed on this current system, the United States would go through hyperinflation. But since we're going to be tokenizing the economy, and we can clearly see that starting up, we're going to be going through hyper deflation. And you guys know I bought you those videos, Ray Kurzweil, a few years ago, letting you see how things would play out. And we see exactly coming to light. And with the Anthony Sutton videos, we know that the drums are going to be beating, but we know it was all planned out in order to move to the NWO's agenda. So even though the mainstream media pushed China and Russia and the United States pinned against each other, we know behind the curtain they're working together. We see all our big banks and big corporations in China, and they know they're about to make trillions while the American empire falls. And remember the crypto teacher told you. Now, guys, do not forget about Grayscale sent about $23.8 billion. But getting over into a little crypto news, we have Hong Kong leading in blockchain. And guys, we know nothing happens in Hong Kong without China. So we see Bitcoin ETFs and crypto trading in Hong Kong. Remember, Hong Kong is just an extension of China. Now we have Symbiosis integrate ZK Sync to lower fees and faster transactions. And we know Symbiosis is a cross-chain liquidity protocol. Now we have BitGit launches a $100 million Web3 fund for crypto projects in Asia. And guys, we know the emerging markets are already set for the fourth industrial revolution, where the robots, algorithms, and drones take the economy over, pay each other with crypto, and the sheep go inside the metaverse. And then lastly, guys, we have lawyer Jeremy Hogan says XRP is not a security because it doesn't fit the category of investment contracts. And guys, we know at the beginning, XRP was definitely a security, just like Ethereum. But now we clearly see the utility. But the question is not whether XRP is a security or not is whether the United States wants XRP protocol in the U.S. And looking at the signs, most likely not. We know the fourth industrial revolution is rising in emerging markets. And if you're a crypto project, you're going to flourish more unless you've already been picked by one of these big banks and big corporations. And we know when it comes to the SEC versus Ripple case, this was all set up as a distraction so they could kick the regulation can down the road. Now that they're ready to bring in global regulation, that's why we know this case is going to be ending soon. And most likely Ripple XRP is going to flourish in the emerging markets. And remember the crypto teacher told you because he knows. When it comes to the New World Order, it's all planned out. But that's all I have for you. Don't forget about the books. It's Crypto Teacher and the New World Order book, plus the three kids' books. It's time to re-educate. Also, New to Crypto's Coinbase, Bitchu, Binance. Do not forget book links and crypto links are in the description. The stock channel, guys. Don't forget to go like, subscribe, spread everywhere. You have your Kobo, your chip size, your banking, your gaming. While everybody's sitting at home, get on stocks, the receiver, the biotech stocks. And while everybody's at home wishing. They were still getting that free money. What are they doing? Drinking and smoking weed. Don't forget about those stocks and you have a wonderful day. The most powerful person in the world is the storyteller. The storyteller sets the vision, values, and agenda of an entire generation to come. Steve Jobs. And guys, you know I truly believe in this. When you look at the New World Order, they're the storytellers. And that's the reason why I wrote my New World Order book. But guys, now it's time to change the current generation. And I wrote three kids books. You know, I love the Trinity because I understand the power that's in it. So I have three books. We have an opportunity to change the generation, to educate, not just me, but I want to show you that I take action on a daily basis. 
And I want you to take action on a daily basis, whether it's your job, whether it's in your community. We have an opportunity right now to educate the masses. I posted this on my Twitter account. Please share. But this is a short clip of the three books. There's going to be a clothing line and action figures. Please get these books for your kids, nephews, cousins, friends. So therefore, we can start the re-education now. Because as we see, the fourth industrial revolution foundation is definitely here. Robots, algorithms, drones, taking humanity out the picture. We have to re-educate. But let's get into the video. Part 1. King Joshua and Grandma Tim save the village. Part 2. King Joshua and Grandma Tim save New York. Long COVID-33. Part 3. King Joshua and Grandma Tim go to China. It's mandatory to get Part 1, Part 2, and Part 3 of this series. It's time to re-educate Generation Z.